Okay, so what we have here is my, I guess my true introduction to the black rifle market. And this is the Smith & Wesson MP15T. And this is the tactical version of uh, Smith & Wesson's entry into the, uh, I guess, the the tactical rifle or the AR-15 market and I purchased this I think it was back in 2006 or 2007 and I was actually waiting patiently for the SIG 556 to come out but it seemed as if it would never come out so with money burning a hole in my pocket I decided to go for something that I thought was the next best thing. Now I cannot compare this to other AR varieties because I have not shot a lot of them. But Smith & Wesson does have a good reputation. They do make quality firearms. And I figured that, well, since it's relatively new, I think that this was relatively new at the time, um, I decided to go with this. Of course, it is tactical, as you can see. It comes with the, uh, the flat top. Um, the entire thing is Picatinny rail from, <laughs> you know, almost the entire length of, uh, I would say, uh, this is almost the... Almost half the length of the uh, the rifle itself is Picatinny on the top. The forend has Picatinny on the top, bottom, and both sides. Okay, this is empty, no magazine in the well, and nothing in the chamber. Um. It has the fold-down sights. Let's see the fold-down. And of course, the folding stock to make it more compact. Let's flip those up. And flip that up. Let me get a little closer. It has a two position rear sight so that you can actually fold it down or up for your longer distance shots. See that folds up and down. You can adjust the windage right or left. And to date, I haven't had any problems with this. I have modified this none at all. I do have a sling that I will install on this shortly. And as you all know, this is the 5.56 millimeter or .223 caliber. It's very light. I'm not sure of the exact weight. I would say probably no more than five and a half pounds. And let's see if we can get a closer look at that. So you can actually see through the sights there. And the shoulders nicely. very accurate and as I said so far it's proven to be very reliable just with these uh, ARs you just have to keep them clean and this is no exception I'm sure 
and I take good care of my rifles anyway, so that's never a problem. But in any case, I thought I would just uh, take a little time to showcase my Smith & Wesson. MP15T, the T standing for tactical. Alright, thanks for watching and let me know what you uh, think about my black rifle. Thanks. Bye-bye.